The lawyer for convicted killer Euron Vandersloot claims his client has been stabbed at least two times at a remote maximum security prison in southern Peru. The first was on the 27th of October when he suffered three stab wounds to the upper part of his left shoulder at the back. And on Sunday, the 2nd of November, he was stabbed for a second time. This wound was much more serious as it was four and a half inches deep and close to his right kidney. Vandersloot was recently transferred to the Chayapaca prison for disciplinary reasons. His lawyer claims prisoners are purposely targeting him. The inmates have realized that if anything were to happen to Joran Vandersloot, for example, if Joran Vandersloot were to die, as a consequence, the prison would close, and this is what they are trying to do, close the prison. And to do this, they are using Joran Vandersloot as a guinea pig. Prison officials deny the claims, saying Vandersloot has superficial wounds on his abdomen that were probably self-inflicted. Vandersloot is the prime suspect in the 2005 disappearance of American teen Natalie Holloway. He's serving a 28-year prison sentence for the 2010 murder of a woman in Peru. Hannah Bookdahl, Associated Press.